Good morning my beautiful friends and welcome back to another what I eat in a day video. All of the pool recipes will be down in the description below. For breakfast this morning I started by first of all making a pancake batter from buckwheat flour, almond meal, cacao powder and baking soda before adding in some almond milk as well as some vanilla and also some rice malt syrup which you may be able to tell by now is my sweetener of choice. I also added in one flax egg which I made from one tablespoon of flax meal and three tablespoons of water before mixing that all together. Then I greased the pan with some Nutilex which is a vegan butter before cooking up my vegan pancakes and flipping them like a pro if I do say so myself. I then served them up like so before adding some fresh strawberries as well as some roasted hazelnut butter which I made just from some roasted hazelnuts, almond milk, rice malt syrup and salt which I blended all together. And that is how I made my breakfast this morning. It was certainly a very delicious and desserty way to start my day. Moving on to lunch and I first of all started by toasting two pieces of gluten free bread and cooking up some olive oil, garlic and half a can of minced chickpeas in a frying pan. I also added in some of my homemade cashew parmesan and fried that all up. Once my toast was all cooked I added some avocado on top which I mashed on then served with some of the fried chickpea mixture as well as some lemon and that is how easy my lunch was today. This is slowly but surely becoming a staple in my diet. Moving on to dinner and I started by first of all boiling some water over the stove and cooking some chickpea gluten free pasta. I also sliced up some cherry tomatoes, fried them in some olive oil and then covered them with a lid so that they would soften like so. I then added in a clove of fresh garlic which I chopped up. I fried that for a little while and then added in my cooked pasta. Continued frying that and added in some herbs like so. I fried that up for a little while longer and then served in a bowl, topped it with some of my homemade cashew parmesan again and that was a very simple dinner for me tonight and also concludes what I ate today. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.